And we are learning much more about that rash of stolen cargo trailers we first told you about last month. Police initially said there had been seven trailers stolen in a three-week period here in the metro area. Now they say the number is in the hundreds. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez uncovering new details about the theft ring. Trailers like this one, which are used to haul everything from landscaping equipment to construction tools, are being stolen by the hundreds. It was found all the way up in Sterling. Robert Lee's brand new trailer, stolen last month in Thornton, was found abandoned a week later in Logan County, minus $2,000 worth of tools. It sounded like it was a couple meth head drug dealers of some sort that had stolen the trailer. Another trailer stolen in Thornton the same week ended up in Alamosa. Police are now investigating a major theft ring. All they'll say, though, is that it's multi jurisdictional. We had three, four traders over there. This man, who wants to remain anonymous, says his brother and his brother's friends, who he says all use meth, parked several stolen traders on this lot last March. I told him to knock it off and get the stuff off my mother's property. He says he confronted his brother, and his brother charged at him, so he hit him with a hammer. He's the one who's now been charged with assault. I asked how he knew the traders were stolen. When the fourth one showed up, it was, it was a tandem dump painted yellow, and six guys jumped out at midnight and started spray painting it black. He says he's talked to investigators, but so far no arrests have been made. Police say they're still trying to determine who will take the lead in this multi jurisdictional investigation. Lance Hernandez, 7 News.